Hey Mandy Maniacs! So, today I am reviewing Sally Hansen Insta Dry Hollow Glow. The color is Chrome Zone. And yes, that's exactly what is on my nails right now. So, I would um, give it a don't recommend. That is, uh, yeah. See this in the bottle? It looks so pretty, right? See that? In the nail, it does not. Not at all. What's really awful is like, I don't know if this is coming through on camera. What's really, really awful is like, it has this texturing. It's horrible. See that? So it looks like it's ugly. It looks like... It's really textured and like bumpy and just yuck because what happened was the glitter in this instead of Popping and giving you the hollow glow you see in the bottle It didn't do that instead like I don't know what went wrong here, but The glitter gets overtaken by the color and the glitter sits like right under the color so It gives it just a really bumpy ugly finish um also it's like not it's like see-through in some spots and i put it on evenly it just doesn't it doesn't give even coverage you know it's just it it's a really ugly 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 nail polish as you guys can see um, I do not recommend this at all. Mind you, I have a glossy top coat on, and as you can see, yeah, no. Um, even with that glossy top coat, it does not cover the, like, bumpy, rough texture. So, I would call this nail polish an epic fail. Don't do it. You can find much better. I was kind of excited to see it. Um, like, oh wow, that's interesting because I use, mostly I use gel, like the light. Um, and I have used powders that are holographic powders and they come out beautiful. So I'm like, oh, that might be cool. It's like a one-stop shop. You don't have to go through and do all the powders, you know, all that, um, much easier. Well, not really, because it's very, very ugly, and it did not work out hollow at all. If you look at it in the right light, it totally looks hollow in the bottle. But that does not come through on your nails whatsoever. I'm even wondering if their nail polish is hollow, or if they have something in the bottle's glass that gives it that, because it sure does not give it that rainbowy color shift on your nails. It just... It reminds me of like maybe tar. I don't know. It's really, really ugly. Um, so that is my takeaway. It's a fail. Um, it was, how much was it? It was $5 and something. I can't remember exactly. I got it at Target. I think it was like $5.94 or $5.99. Um, save your money because she's ugly. Very ugly. Um, the the nail powders, they're more work, but so much more reward because this polish is a flop. So that's my review. I hope you enjoyed it. It saves you some time and money. And remember to follow or subscribe and like. Bye!